start with a growing frustration over finding open vaccine appointments. New at 6, some tech-savvy people in the Bay Area are taking matters into their own hands with social media pages like these. KPI X5's Katie Nielsen explains how, how these so-called vaccine vigilantes are using their skills to help people navigate the system, so to speak. Katie? Yeah, Liz, mass vaccination sites like this one at the Santa Clara County Fairgrounds are vaccinating thousands of people a day, but many say even though they're eligible, they're still struggling to find an appointment. That's where these vaccine hunters step in to help. I'm a mechanical engineer. I work for a major tech company here in the Bay Area. Michael Brockman uh, doesn't have a healthcare background, but he says he's become an expert in navigating the COVID vaccine appointment sites. So when I found out that some of my uh, neighbors and other eligible family members um, were having trouble uh, booking through the various online appointment systems, um, I figured I might be able to use some of the uh, tech skills I have to help them secure appointments. So far, he says he's helped more than two dozen eligible people successfully book appointments for a COVID vaccine. It is sort of frustrating that this is um, underground knowledge, but the knowledge is out there to a certain extent, and it's just kind of a matter of getting to it. One person created a Twitter bot to find appointments, where an automated program searches the MyTurn website constantly for available slots, then tweets out the details. Another online tool is the Facebook group Bay Area Vaccine Hunters. It was started barely a month ago by Fremont residents Abhishek uh, and his wife you, Pooja. And we, we were just talking one day and we were like, hey, let's, let's create a group. And then we were wondering, like, who would even join? The group now has more than 4,500 members all sharing information, but they have a strict no line jumping policy. They remove any posts about ineligible people looking to get a vaccine. If young people or other people are just jumping in line, that's, that's not fair to the ones who are more in need. Those involved with these online groups say they were created out of necessity. Frustration with current systems not being able to meet the need. A situation that could be amplified as millions more people become eligible for the vaccine on the 15th. We're going to hopefully be getting more and more vaccines over the next three weeks. The last thing we want is any glitches in this, the program we're providing now. Santa Clara County is actually so concerned about transitioning to a statewide appointment system that they've asked to opt out and leave things as they are, just going through the county to schedule those vaccine appointments. Liz? All right, Katie Nielsen, thank you.